about it earlier, how people just came out of the hyperbolic time chamber. Yeah. It's kind of like uh, talking about that on the last time of Dragon yeah, Ball yeah. Z. Except for we're talking MSM, so. I was near, nowhere near the time chamber, I'll tell you that. <laughs> I mean, some people came out, like, absolutely insane. Super Saiyan 2 yeah. status, ready to go take on anybody else, win a tournament. And some other people, not naming myself, um, <laughs> pro all came out and were, were like Vegeta. Thought they were amazing, but they didn't do much. <laughs> well, Vegeta's still pretty strong, man, so, you know. I, I can't even call myself Vegeta. I'm like I'm like uh, Pickle Yamcha, bro. I'm like Yamcha <laughs> getting bodied. Like, nah, man. <laughs> yeah. No, no, it, it really is. I, I just am not. I'm not where I once was. It's not to say that I was, you know, anywhere good. But we all getting back in the hang of it, my guy. What will be good is this match between Arkistor and Kintuse. I'm not familiar with Kintuse, so let's see what character he opts for here. And again, Arkistor. Okay, we got the Ken versus. Ah. Pyramithra, uh, that is so Arkister. I why like it. Why did I not just? Guess? I knew it. Five ninety nine. <laughs> Five ninety nine, baby. Hey, you know, depends on who you ask. Maybe this character isn't uh, Five ninety nine at all. I saw Zan tweeting about it a little bit. Uh, yeah, Zan's got definitely a good character, though. <laughs> well, for sure. But of course, it doesn't matter. Ken has the hard hits and the super combo strings with it, yeah. so it'll be interesting to go ahead and see that for the starters right now. It starts out. Kintu is putting in some pretty good percent. You got the Tatsumaki Temple Yaku already going with it. Great focus for it, too. You're just putting on Arkister 88%. Kind of rough. Yeah. So we're starting off the match with uh, Mithra, of course, a little bit more light, nimble, quicker, uh, able to combo a little bit better than Pyra. We'll see if he switches to the Pyra once he's got some damage on the board. He's got about 56 now. In fact, I think at this percent, he might even be able to switch and like steal a stock with a good read. But if he can. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, He's already got the switch. Kintuse not giving him too much opportunity there. Ooh, Ooh. and he just missed his combo. Kintuse actually probably could have taken that. Gets the flaming edge. If Arkister gets a solid read here, he could take a stock, but with the hard-hitting use of, of Mithra. Sorry, that's Pyro. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> no, I mean, this guy, he also picked the color that, like, they're both the same. <laughs> oh, they oh both my gosh, off Dragon the stage. Ball Let's Z. Go. <laughs> <laughs> what a way to take the first stocks in this set. Oh, yeah. First stock gone for both players, but once again, Kintuse just racking up the damage mighty quickly. Already 55 onto Arkistor. I like that little combo and the way he used that platform action. That was pretty hype, actually, for the start for it. But Arkister getting, uh, finding ways around this focus. He's been getting all those multi-hits in. This is very even in the percent, very super back and forth. Yeah, speaking of those multi-hits, I feel like that uh, side B is going to be pretty useful to break through that focus attack, like you just said, uh, especially because it's got range. Right. Yeah. No, this is going to be interesting with that, but he's also been walling pretty well with the Sadukens. Trying to find his way in. Good Nair. Finds a straight hit, but not this stock. That's and it. And Kintu's yep. going to take the second stock from Arkister. Yeah, that down tilt into the Shoryuken. Uh, I'm going to assume that was the input, because this he, he looks like he knows what he's doing, man. It is, but that was still some spaghetti. There's a little bit of improvement that Kintu's can go ahead and improve here with his combos. But then again, it is kind of weird. Mithra's a weird space oh my character. God. Arkistor ready, charging up that forward smash, but Kintusa just gonna see right through that. Ooh, good ray of punishment. It's the back throw, he has him off the stage. Oh. Down air. Up smash, it missed the second hit. Oh. I'm so surprised with that, really well played there. Is that gonna kill? Yeah, That's gonna kill the face you. splat on the side there. Last stock on game one. To be fair, Kintusa did have a ton of percent on that stock. I think he had about 170 at that point. You right. Just getting off the side there, getting chased down by the side there. Kintu's not letting Arkister go. Yeah, this is, this is a really uh, precarious situation for Arkister. I mean, he needs to make something happen, but he's also at a percent where if he gets hit one more time, Kintuse might be able to convert into the stock, so he's got to play this really carefully. Oh! Barely be able to get past that. Good roll away from him. Jumps on this. I saw oh. the pistol. Oh, oh, get the down What air. a Shoryuken! What a punish. Beautiful stuff from Kintuse right there. Seeing right through that overcommitment from Arkistor. Landing on it with the uh, neutral air. Converting into the up tilt. Shoryuken. That was a beautiful combo. It really was. And a beautiful I, punish. I like it to say. I'm surprised I've never seen him before actually playing. But uh, I wonder which, which region he's from. He's got the he's got the furry tail going with that. Too. He's, got, he's got the fox tail. I don't I don't know if that's a fox tail or it's some other fox some tail. other some other kind of critter. But <laughs> it, it looks cool. I yeah. dig it. I dig it. I dig. Bringing the fire. 
But yeah, let's see if Arkansas um, stays with Myra, Pithra, uh, and Pithra, Myra, Myra, <laughs> Myra, Pyra, and Myra Mithra. And Mithra. Oh my God. I got you. Dyslexia. <laughs> but uh, yeah, it's a brand new character, so you never know. But it looks like he's he's pretty confident. That was a last stock situation, so I'll give it to him. And he's actually going to make it a little bit easier for us, too, and go with the uh, standard colors. You know, that confuses me because I've chosen those colors before, and it messes me up. Like, I don't know which Oh, no, they I'm made using. it opposite colors. That would be harder for me now. Oh, okay, yeah. Uh, I mean, at least the two characters are different colors now. You're right. You're right. Still working with it. Good music actually coming from the five stream. I love this stage. I'm so happy North Cave is actually one of the legal stages for this map. Yeah, that's cool. I don't know too much about the like stage boundaries itself. Oh, hold up. Hold. Let me shut up. Hold up. Hold up. Jeez, yeah. Kintu is already putting on 79%. It felt like Orchestra's hard work and it has suddenly just been stopped. Again, reading through these focus attacks, though, using the multi-hits to break through. Arc Store putting himself in a really good spot with the pretty big oh. lead. Okay, F-Tilt. I was about to say, can't wondering tell. Wondering if he couldn't convert into that Choryuken oh, focus. there. focus! That was a really good focus right there. That could have been the stock, too, but he stopped himself right there. Good yeah. up smash. Arc Store going to find himself taking the first stock. See if he's got the adaptation now. Kintu's and then poss a possibility to go and take some good hits. Nice back air. Needy take back that air. stock without taking any damage of his own. We're back to an even game. Uh huh. The back and forth between these two players is actually pretty interesting. I wonder how long uh, Kinsu has actually been playing. I don't know, but it, I mean, it looks like he's very comfortable with his character and definitely in the matchup a little bit. Absolutely. Oh, look at the focus into the forward air. I was surprised get, nobody ever expects that. Almost felt like that was planned. I like it. You know, and it makes sense that uh, Kintuse might know the matchup a little bit better just because, like, you know, that My Myra and P uh, Pith? Pyra? And Pyra Mithra and Mithra. I got you. Are brand new characters, so, you know, a lot of people have been playing them lately, but I don't know if Arkestor really has too much Ken experience. And if he does, like, maybe not with this character. Yeah, no, it's, it's, it's a completely different. Ooh, good forward smash action from that. I like the spacing for it. He's starting to play a little bit more cautious. See a lot of the turnarounds. He's actually taking steps back, but he doesn't get quite man. get it. He gets that Beyblade, lets it rip. Yeah, he's he off the screen. Ooh, right back at him. It's down the last stock again. <laughs> yeah, man, these, these stocks are happening awfully fast, like not giving me a whole lot of time to talk about what just happened. But <laughs> hey, that's what we like to see. Quick, high-paced matches. That's down the to the last stock. Ooh, he's oh, he's keeping him off the screen. OK, that was the biggest. Mithra combo I'd seen from Arkestor so far in this. I actually, I really wanted the up be the ray of punishment to go ahead and see if he can actually oh, kill afterwards. No, just missed. Get the up smash. Unfortunately, Ken was a little bit too far behind Pyra. Ooh, Hadouken goes right through that. I'm surprised. Uh oh, but I thought that could be death. It, all, it feels like the next touch could go ahead and kill Arkestor. Oh, oh, and it didn't. He all just right. missed the connection. Yeah, Arkestor punishing with a down smash. Okay, back. Oh, holding oh, no. shield all the way through that. Oh my nice. gosh! Wow, that came out surprisingly fast. I thought for sure Kintus was going to go ahead and get fast. that kill. I mean, Kintuse thought he had the punish as well, but he Arkister. thought Arkister putting himself on the board. We got an even set 1-1 one, one situation. Absolutely kind of interesting so far for the, for the two players. Yeah. And things like so that. tell me, ah. since you're such a fan of Northern Cave, like, what is the difference between Northern Cave and uh, what's the stage that it's replacing? Uh, uh, a Pokemon Kalos. 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 Kalos, yeah. Well, the idea was that now you can go under it. The idea that you had wall cleans and things that you could go ahead and ah, do with that. Right. You, you could drop wall, really low, wall, and yeah. Sephiroth could go ahead and stip a, stick a sword in that half of the stage. Okay. But, so that idea that now you can't really do that, you can't drop that low and stick that well, I think that's what the idea is we're getting. That's what about, what about the... Um, the blast zones, are those similar? Uh, similar, I guess. I honestly haven't done the, that much research to it. I just know the stage itself is a lot nicer in case if you have to play somebody like Greninja or Sephiroth over on the side or anybody with the wall stick. Nonetheless, we're not going to play game three on Northern Cave. We're going to Pokemon Stadium instead. Or PlayStation 2, as a lot of people like to call it. <laughs> 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 anyway, but back to the even percentage though, the first stocks is going to be pretty tense. You can see uh, some of them are already like throwing out some defensive options. Could get oh. that combo, and Kintus going to go ahead and take that first stock. Yeah, not much we can do. I mean, really, it's on the Ken player to really execute. Once they get one of those tilts in, that first hit, they can convert to stock. Oh, they can kill. In, uh, Quick. A lot of situations. You know, got to really make use of that SDI to fall out of those combos, too. If you can. 
Good side beat from Argostar trying to get him off him, but he's still getting lapped in percent almost. He's got to go ahead and find a way to either get this kill wow. or just not get killed like that. That Shoryuken is actually nuts. That was a nice uh, damage for combo. So I think because it, it, since it didn't kill, it tells me that he uh, didn't use the command input for that Shoryuken, but he was able to just get some damage and with the simple up B. Uh, nonetheless, Archosaur taking the stock right back up. Maybe too Ooh. little too late with 123%. Oh. He does have him off stage, though. Ooh. Down smash, no jump. put him back off. Ooh. Oh, if he had just gotten that hit, it might have been a different story. But Archosaur oh. is going to lose that stock in Kintuse. Kintuse yeah. fading away and hitting him with that F smash. Up a solid stock of his own. Still racking up that damage. Really bad spot for Archosaur here at the ledge. Oh. Switching back to Pyra. Oh, no. Hadouken's keeping him back out of the bay. All right, on the stage. stage. That's been giving him trouble. That Hadouken's been really good at keeping Archer out of the way. Parries it, but not able to find a punish it. Right, really bad spot for Archer here now. Whoa. Ooh, that was nice. <laughs> good switch. I yeah. I mean, damn. I didn't even know, realize you could use it like that. Yeah, I know. It's for avoiding hits and things like that. Good dash attack. Ooh, and oh, and gets there. Okay. okay, so now he has 80%. He's in a rough situation. He has to go ahead and start putting the percent on a Katuse. Right. This combo could be his answer. It looks like Archistor is hyper-focused. He's halfway there, more than halfway there now with 46% on to Katuse. Make that 63, and he's got him off stage. Oh, no! Oh! But he doesn't get the kill. A little bit of a hiccup there for Katuse. I think he's starting to get the nerves, too. Absolutely, man. I think Down that's, the wire. The, that's the incredible thing about playing at these early rounds. The pressure that you can fit, feel from these oh. things. He gets the switch. I thought he was going to go for it. He gets wow. the It doesn't spike. Oh, no. Oh, oh. oh this is incredible. Oh. Okay, he's back to the side there. Tries to go in. Gets the uppy off of it. He gets the flame edge. He's Mithra right now. Oh, no. He misses. Oh, that's and it. that's going to be the game. Congratulations, Kintuse taking a 2-1, and Arkistor shaking his head a little bit. He knew he could have done it, but 